So let's solve this problem. So how to interpret a five-point Likert scale results? So we have these five responses. One for strongly disagree, two for disagree, three for neutral, four for agree, and five for strongly agree. Then to create a Likert scale, so first we need to find the range and to find the range so we have the highest number minus the smallest number so the range is equal to 4 then from the range we can find now the interval and to find the interval so we have the range divided by the highest number so the interval is equal to 0 0.8 or 0 0.80 then to create now a scale, so since 1 is strongly disagree, so this is 1.00. Then for disagree, since the interval is 0 0.80, so 0 0.80 plus 1, so this is 1.80. Then for neutral, so we have this 1.80 plus the interval, that's 0 0.80, so this is 2.60, then for agree, so 2.60 plus 0.80, that's 3.40, and for strongly agree, that's 3.40 plus the interval, 0 0.80, so this is 4.20, so these are now the lower limit, and to find the higher limit, since this is 1.80, so therefore, the higher limit for this class is 1.79. Then for this class, for this agree, since this one is 2.60, so the higher limit is 2.59. Then for neutral, since this is 3.40, therefore, this is 3.39. Then for agree, since this is 4.20, so the higher limit is 4.19. And for the last one, this is 5.00. So this is now the 5-point Likert scale. And to use this scale, so if we have this seven respondents, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and these are the response for every questions. So first, we need to find the average for every questions. So for question number one, to find the average, so just add all the numbers, divide by the number of respondents, since we have 7 respondents, so add all the numbers, divide by 7. So we have 3 plus 4 plus 2 plus 4 plus 3 plus 5 plus 1 equals, then divide by 7. So the average is 3.14. So this is 3.14. Then for question number 2, to find the average, so we have 4 plus 4 plus 5 plus 4 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 equals, then divide by 7. So the average is 3.71. Then for question number 3, to find the average, so this is 2 plus 3 plus 1 plus 2 plus 2 plus 4 plus 2 equals then divide by 7. So that's 2.29. Then for question number 4, to find the average, so we have 4 plus 4 plus 3 plus 5 plus 5 plus 3 plus 5 equals then divide by 7 so the average is 4.14 
in this time from this average, we can interpret now the results from this Likert scale. So for question number one, since the average is 3.14 and 3.14 belongs to this scale, so therefore in question number one, most of the respondents are neutral. Then for question number two, since the average is 3.71 and 3.71 belongs to the scale, so therefore in question number two, most of the respondents are agree. Then for question number three, since the average is 2.29 and 2.29 belongs to the scale so therefore most of the respondents disagree then for question number four since the average is 4.14 and 4.14 belongs to the scale so therefore most of the respondents in question number four agree so this is how to interpret a 5-point Likert scale result.